Hello and welcome back to Rollercoaster Tycoon, where um, we got ourselves this nice filled up park. Nice, not beautiful, <laughs> with all these supports, but nice, it is nice. It is gaining more guests, it is profitable as hell, I mean, well, I don't know if hell is profitable, but I certainly know that we are making cash like crazy cash that I can feel burning in my wallet because that's where I have 10 grand. <laughs> no, uh, but yeah, I do want to spend it. And like I said, you know, I want to build the coaster right next to this steel one and it's going to be there. However, there are more things on the agenda because I also want the river right here. You know, the grown up brother of the lock film that we got over here. However, there is a catch to that because that track is really really inflexible to build. It only has big curves and well there's only a steep drop but no steep lift and well I know it's inflexible to build with and well there's already a coaster over here but I still want it you know I mean that ride has the potential to go up to into the sevens if we build a good one. So yeah I feel we need that and you know i've also got a spot for that in mind and that is like right above well not you know not literally above but like above this uh river rapid station that we got going over here and then like one tile behind it you know one square so that's where i want it um it's gonna be crazy difficult though because if we turn back on like these squares you know you can see that for example, there are lot, lots and lots of spaces over here where we only got like two squares of, of cliffside. And that means that we wouldn't even be able to get out of the cliff from that area because, well, you know, we can only make wide curves and they are like a three by three square. So I did some, uh, some thinking about it and, well, we got, you know, three by three area over here. And same over here. However, over here, we are with the difficulty of this lift here, which is blocking off a lot of, well, area over here, you know, for our own lift. So what I'm thinking of doing is having the station be like behind here, like I said, and then have it go in this direction. Well, that's the plan. Um, whether or not it will be successful, I don't know, because, like I said, we do need to somehow manage to get our way through here. And then what I want to do is, once we succeed in that, I want to start utilizing this cliffside on the other side. Well, um, <laughs> so far, I've only been talking about a ride. <laughs> you know what? Let's build it. So, here we go. Uh, first, I would like to get... Oh, no. I would like to get ourselves in the position, you know, where I want to be in with the station. So we'll get there first. This is the height that I have in mind. Uh, we'll just go straight here until we are a good bit underground. Now I'll remove everything and I should be able to S-bend my way into the other side. Yes, this is the line of tiles where I want to be. Now I don't know really where the station should start. Well, let's try it from over here. I know that we start out with an S-band. Uh, how high do... I, well, height 3 is not going to work because we're going to have waterfalls over there. So the station needs to be back a little bit more. And let's see if we can manage to get up to height 5. Then an S-band. Can I get a curve out now? No. So height 4, is that acceptable? S-band. And then... Yes, that, so far so good. Now I know that there's the other coaster, so we kind of need to go behind that. Change the view now for it. Uh, and then we'll have an s to the other side again. Nice, so far so good. I'm liking where this is going. Right. Then a curve here, because over here it's two tiles wide, so otherwise we wouldn't be able to go anywhere. And right now, we are inside the cliff. First part of the mission accomplished, I'd say. So we'll get ourselves up. That's where we want to be, right? Up, up, and away, <laughs> as they say. <laughs> oh no, what? It rhymes? <laughs> I am crazy. I knew that. Right, so we're going to have 
um, in a, a gap over here. I'm not going to terraform the crap out of it because, well, actually, no, no, wait, no, 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 no. That's crazy. I know we got plenty of cash, but we shouldn't be wasting it on stupid things. And then again, maybe it's not such a bad idea, coming to think of it. You know what? We are gonna terraform it because I want to utilize this cliffside to the max. Crap. Yes. So what I'm thinking of doing right now, uh, and this is gonna be even more terraforming, I'm afraid, but... Oh, that's... Ooh, we are actually on the support limit more or less as well for the cliff. Okay, so I don't really need to go that much higher. However, this means that I need to raise two cliff height over here. And right now, can't do that because there's a queue. So yeah, we definitely need to curve around over here. I'm not really, you know, I don't mind doing that. So, however, that is going to be crazy, crazy expensive. I know that. These need to be raised like over here. The same for this one, really. Look. All right, now... This should work the moment I raise this one. Okay, so now... Um, <laughs> oh, and I think this one. Yeah, all right. I know that this is crazy expensive, but I think that the ride should be worth it all in all. Look at that. Height 29. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I think that that is quite an achievement, if I'm honest. Height freaking 29. Oh. There is this coaster, but I think that we can get away from that with a clever S-Band. S-Bands are always clever. At least that's what they told me. <laughs> um, so, oh, and look at that. Right. I do want to get... I don't want to do too much over here. I want to have a massive drop and then go to a place back here. You know, curve around. In fact, I kind of want to do that as soon as possible, really. Let's see. Right now I'm at height 8. Is that, you know, passable at any given point here? Height 8. As long as I can go above the wooden coaster. I think it's... Yeah, no, that's bad. That's not gonna happen. And I might be running into... Yeah, alright. So maybe I need to drop this to, like, below height 8. So, uh, you know, to height 3 more. I can go below the steel mini coaster. Yeah, this is looking more promising, if I'm honest. Oh, am I partially... Wait, hold on a second, let me get... Alright, so if I extend this one, does that solve any issues? Alright, um, let's see. Partially above and below ground, you say. So, this... Oh, oh, that's nice. Do I run into the path? I have a feeling that I am going to. No, I don't. Well, that's a real surprise for me. Oh, oh, this is, oh, this is really, really interesting. Quite liking where this is going. Oh, but there is a footpath. Anyway. Right, can I S-bend around that? Oh, there has been clicks. I can. Does that lead me straight into the wooden coaster? I think it does, actually. Yeah, it does. I drop down. Does that help anything? No, it doesn't. Okay. So, we will have a curve over here. I don't think that there's any real alternative. No, no, there isn't. Alright. Alright, that's alright though. So far, so good. Now, what I really want to do is also... Oh, okay. Maybe I need to get this view back on. I have a feeling I'm running into a coaster. <laughs> I mean, well, the game says that, so I guess that must be true. I would love to go up over here, but really, I don't really think that that's going to happen anytime soon. Though, then again, having said that, why don't we get, just give it a go, really? I mean, our station is like all the way up here, so we got quite a bit of space to play around in, right? Okay. I am right below the mouse coast. So if I move this a little bit more over here, because this is right below this bridge where we do not have a lot of stuff anyway. Look, 
Right now, I can actually go below ground again at reasonable heights. I can make the curve now and we'd still be in the park and all that. So that's pretty good actually. I'm liking this. I'm liking where this is going. You know what? I'll try and resurface over here. Get this out here like so. Okay. Um, I don't want to go too high with it, but what we are going to do, quite cheeky, make it an S-Band switch. And then we'll have another drop here. I know I'm not aligned with our own station. We need to be on, you know, where we were before the S-Band. That's the right line of tiles, so to say. But we will get ourselves there. Look, with another S-Band. Oh, no, <laughs> not that one. Uh, come on, to the left, yes. Oh, look at that. Look at this. The beauty. It hooks up. It's not maximum station length. I'm fully aware of that. But look at... Man, that's really nice, actually. It was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Well, it wasn't exceptionally easy. But it wasn't that difficult, either. Pretty good. Pretty happy with that. We are going to hook it up. Well, you guys may report the test results on me once they're finished think that this was the yeah that was the queue the entrance good look we will just have this be over here and this ride can handle such a long queue i know that because this ride is freaking awesome i mean <laughs> they stash like 16 peeps i think on one of those boats so i mean that alone makes it super awesome right trash can and, uh, we will just quickly put that there Oh, balls. <laughs> and already I closed... No, crap. I closed the window. Yeah, go and check that out. While I get ourselves some stuff over here. I'm sure there will be lots of vomit involved in this ride. Look, that's your area. Now, another thing that we should do, you know, as well as setting this one up. And we're going to assume that it's good. So we're going to charge six bucks for this. We probably could get away with seven and well, you know, I'm feeling very bold here because I don't even know the ratings, but just saying. Um, anyway, the one thing that I wanted to do really that we haven't really got here is uh, facilities and I wanted to build a few of those because I do seem to recall that I kind of neglected those, uh, you know, when we opened this up and I never really got to build them here. So I might as well do that now and um, let's get this view out here better about well, some really bad thing. I can see more clearly now the rain is gone <laughs> so then we will have a pizza hut here look it's only the second pizza hut that we got so really need it totally called for oh <laughs> the boner <laughs> oh man the stuff that I come up with and look, that's also like a second hat style. We're gonna go with orange, you know, to mix it up a bit. There. Now, oh wow, they haven't even made it like through the first lift. They're still lifting upwards and height 30 is crazy high. So, pretty good. Looking pretty good so far. Um, we will be, you know, coloring this as I know that, wow, well, you know. <laughs> Oh man, top speed man. Alright, let, let's just quickly check that so we can see like what it will be, you know, top speed and all. So I think it'll be quite good actually. I mean, 29 to height 3, that should be crazy. And afterwards, you know, we will leave this running and I'll color it and all that and then... 100, I saw it, I saw 3 digits. <laughs> wow! <laughs> yeah, this ride's gonna be good. We need to give this a fitting name. How about the... Uh, yeah, how about we're gonna call this the... Aquastein Water Frenzy. Yeah. Well, that sounds good, right? It sounds fitting for a ride that reaches a freaking hundred. The, uh, you know, on the speed. I mean, <laughs> for such a water ride, that's like, that's extreme, man. Totally up to my in my alley, if you ask me. And, um, well, 
now there is the coloring because this is again another big cliff of support <laughs> i mean it seems that this park is really doomed to be one of the ugliest parks <laughs> that we've ever built not one of you know it's certainly doing well i mean look at this 17 grand we are gonna have ourselves a grand coaster well, I've said that like 10 times now, and <laughs> each time it wasn't grand, but this time I truly feel we will have a real grand coaster. Anyway, in terms of coloring, I'm thinking of a yellow-purple combination over here. And then maybe with like uh, these supports. Okay, not. No, 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 no. Totally come back on that idea. White. Actually... Look, let's take a zoomed out look and see how it combines with the rest. I must say that I actually quite like these white supports. I do want to check out a few others, see how they look. Doesn't look so bad either, but there is already so much brown. <laughs> I mean, it makes it really look like, you know, the whole park is made out of wood. And it's not. <laughs> I mean, we got a boner in it as well. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we're going to go with the white. I quite like that. Oh, crap. No, those are the boats. Balls. Uh, we're going to leave those brown. To be honest, I think that the brown and red, you know, what the boats are called. I think that looks quite all right. So, we're going to leave that. But, well, there it is. This is, you know, the river ride. Quite amazed that we managed to get that in there. Really quite amazed by that and happy now i'm looking over here and i'm already thinking about you know the next coaster which we are gonna build um it's going to be the steel corkscrew one because that's the only one that i see fit to squeeze around everywhere i want it to be a bit over here a bit over here and not so much over here i want to leave this space for yet another coaster Maybe it wouldn't be such a bad idea to actually have the steel corkscrew coaster go all the way over here. And I think we should build like another coaster here at some point too, so I might not want to do that. Well, 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 well. All right. Um. Yeah. All right. I got. I got an idea. We are gonna build it right now. So right next to this coaster, see if we can crank this one up to grand now, huh? Besides, I'm actually quite curious, I haven't even checked it, but how is this one affected, you know, in terms of ratings? Mm, not so much, actually. I thought that maybe it had a boost because over here, you know, it's really close to it all, but no. <laughs> it didn't affect it much at all, if anything, really, so. Wow. Oh, <laughs> I thought that this was our new water ride, but it's not. Now, this should still be testing. You know what, I'll leave that open as well, so you lot can watch this thing if you don't want to watch me building a coaster. Here, I provide choice and opportunity. How good of me. <laughs> me. Right. Um, well, what we could do, I guess, is go over here. See that we somehow managed to wiggle it in between the loop here. Alright, that's not going to happen because we're just way too low for it. Perhaps um, I might lift this. No. Okay. Well, in that case, we will just go up like we would have done normally. This coast is crazy expensive, and well, we've used quite a bit of real estate over here already. So I'm not gonna go through the trouble of just trying to get a lift over there. That's not going to happen. And, well, you know, because this is like, oh man, now it's, now it's getting real expensive, so I do need to get this down right now. Oh, is it actually finished? No, it's not. <laughs> I thought it was finished, but it isn't. Okay, time to get the building view back on. Um, we are going to have a steel drop until, like, over here. I don't really know. Can I reasonably know that loop is out of reach for any real cool shenanigans? Oh, in fact, I'm actually hitting my own coaster at the moment. Also not so good. I might even be doing that right now, actually, so... 
Okay, you know what? We need ourselves a steep twist in here. Maybe now I can go a bit... Oh, yes, I can definitely go a bit lower. Right now, actually, speed down it might be totally crazy. So I actually might want to have this go up again. Yeah, because there is the footpath. <laughs> so we definitely want to go up. In fact, I'll just keep the drop to a bit more reasonable heights. I mean, we do come from like 30 plus. So that's pretty high up there. And then we'll go up. Do like another steep twist. Like this. We come from 32, huh? Alright. I think right now it wouldn't be such a bad idea to have... A corkscrew in there, and then a half loop. And I don't know where that leaves us. All right, maybe I need to move that whole shenanigan away a bit, so we don't hit like another coaster track. Like right now, now it's perfect. And then go like so. Oh, we could even go below like the wooden coaster. I feel if we do this right. No, because I'm already... Oh yeah, alright, alright, I, I see the issue there. Yep, I'm aware of it, game. Got you there. But, if we do it like this, then... Okay, maybe if I just... Well, this is lame, I mean, we just have, like, a straight piece. Coasters with straight pieces do not fit into my box. I know that much. I kind of want to break up the supports there, really. So, what I'm thinking of doing is... And this is crazy, I know. Well, that's what I'm known for. Oh, no, other side. Look. How does that go? I think this should go quite well. And then do another one to this side. And all of a sudden, we are on the other side of the wooden coaster. Quite a cool track design, if you ask me. Let's get a helix down, large. And then a small one. Oh, and then I can't have yet another small one. Because there's an, without a doubt, there is like some other track out there. <laughs> I mean, there are plenty for us to, you know, well, become stuck at. I'm at height 50 now, right now. I can go below the wooden coaster. And then I need to get my ass out of here because otherwise I'm stuck again. Yeah. Already I'm getting interference with the steel one. Not right now. Interesting. No, but right now we are getting the steel mini one. Oh no, we actually hit the terrain. Oh, <laughs> yeah, we do hit the terrain over here. That is another issue. Kind of forgot about that. I can terraform this though, I think. We only need to be like one level lower. Yeah, we do. Oh, that's nice. Speeds on it will be reasonably high, but this coaster is not shy of a few rough Gs. I know that, so... We don't really have a loop yet, and I think right now would be the perfect moment. Also to move it like one square away from the whole border and if I'm right <laughs> we're doing that below the steel coaster how amazing is that I think that's pretty cool so here and now I want to curve away okay uh, we do need to do that because there is like another lift here so can I do it now no if I go up here can I do it now no. Is that still a steel coaster? I can't for the life of me see that really. Yeah, we are still building right below the steel coaster. That's not good because right now we are stuck there. This gets us out of there. Right now the speed will be pretty low. In fact, so low that I might actually want to try and lift this. Then we will go down in a nice smooth curve. Can I know because there's a steel track, but going straight. Oh, and I so want to go through this loop. And right now we are at the right height to try and pull that off. So we are most definitely going to aim for that. 
look, if I get this curve out here, right now I'm at the loop, I think, so let's see what we can pull off any further here. Let's see. Alright, is that... Oh, I might actually be like far, far off. Oh crap, I want to have this mellow curve here. Now I'm looking at it, yeah, I'm actually still far, far off. That could be rearranged though by going one high level lower. Look, this is what I wanted. Nice. Well, mission accomplished, sorta, of, but we're not gonna stop right here right now. Hell no. Look, this is also a nice maneuver. Now I said I wouldn't want to do too much over there and that still holds true, but I also feel like we're not done with this coaster. Yeah, we can do some more stuff with this, right? Right. So let's see what we can pull out of our asses over here. I don't really know where my build square is at the moment. Oh, <laughs> it's right there. Okay. Can I go in the ground here though? Let's get this view here. Oh, I could. Interesting. Might as well. Yeah, let's let's go in the ground here. See if we can do something cool here, right? Oh, we could have a drop actually. Though that wouldn't be a very long one because we would be on the line that leads outside of the park. This however, say I were to Yeah, like a so. Now <laughs> I run into the coaster. But I could do a helix down and I think that would actually allow yes it does allow me to get out how nice well i think right now we've done quite some crazy stuff with this coaster i think it's a perfect moment to try and see that we somehow i don't know how but that we somehow get this back to the station in a nice and orderly manner <laughs> wow what a track man what a track really i think we need brakes here really at speed 28 so we can do some real tight curvature even tighter than that the good thing is we are at height one and we should have like free range to do whatever we need to to get back to the station so that's good this might in fact i might even hold on let me get the right view here i might even be able to go here without brakes for this part then go like this. What's in the way there? Is that terrain or is that something else? Yeah, that's totally the terrain. And I can't change that. So, but if I make this a smaller curve, then... Alright, I need this to be unbanked. But then, oh no. Oh, would it be this one if I... Look. Cliff <laughs> terror forming. Ah, well, we got the cash now anyway, so we can afford this. Look, this, oh, wow. We actually pulled this off. That is really, really amazing. You know what, just to be sure, so that it doesn't turn out to be too intense, I am going to put a break there. However, we're going to put that at, like, say, 49. Yeah, that would make it acceptable. Okay, and... Ooh, <laughs> I just wanted to say, okay, so this will be finished right now with the testing. Some of you might even be screaming at me, yeah, damage, it's finished a long time ago. Totally forgot about it, but look, 7.1, that's good, that's really good. I mean, I don't think we, we might have had 7.5, but it's definitely on the higher up there. So, yeah, good. How much was I charging? Six bucks? I accept. Be open. We have the queue. We have the manpower. Everything's in place. Make me the profits. Now, this coaster though, I mean, this steel corkscrew one. Um, it is a bit hard to see at the moment. So you know what? We are going to test this. Do I have an entrance and exit to it? No, I don't. I might want to build those first though. If I can get those just over here. Nothing fancy, nothing dandy. That would be perfect. Uh, you know what? We're actually going to put the exit here. Right. So, um, no, but like I was saying, you know, I think that this track's pretty cool. 
Uh, I want to just see really like what we bid exactly, but <laughs> it's a bit difficult to see. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to make it stand out really, like really stand out. It actually doesn't. <laughs> okay, I make this bright green and then bright green again. Well, it still doesn't really. Hmm, <laughs> okay, so it doesn't stand out. Does this stand out? Now it does. Now I feel like I can see it. Maybe on YouTube it's utter crap, but still. What I want to see just is like, well, we have quite a bit of special track features. We got corkscrews, he helixes, loops. You name it, we got it, really. I think that this could truly be a grand coaster. Also, because this is going to synchronize up with the coaster adjacent to it. Now, how does... Look at that. That's almost half a point of rating increase. Wow. Wow. Oh, yes. And I think they get like another half a point for being, uh, you know, next to each other. So, that is going to be pretty good. I'm going to turn this on right now. You know, the synchronize option. And the same over here. Synchronize. I like that. Well, um, guys, if you would be so kind to watch this test ride for me, I am going to hook this sweet baby up. And uh, let's see here. No, 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 no. It's not going to be over there. Now, we are going to hook this one up over here you know, to the main path where all the guests are. Where it's important, you know? Like this. Okay, maybe not like that. No, because that is like, yeah, <laughs> a different Z level altogether. Right, now I should be able to wiggle it in here, no? Yes, like that. Um, alright, so far so good. Where is the exit? Oh, there it is. Right, we will use some great tarmac for this. I don't think there is an actual exit path, though. No. Crap, no, 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 that's not where I want to build this. No. That should hook it up, though. Oh, and now I can't see anything. Man, Cliff is really starting to get difficult with us. Anywho, um, oh, and, oh, look at that. It's actually already back. Oh my god, look at that. It is already back, and it is eight. That's not grand. This one's grand though, but this one isn't? Maybe that is... <laughs> well, we got ourselves one grand coaster, but now this one's not grand anymore. Man, <laughs> oh man, oh man. <laughs> right, so... Can I do something about that though? I'm thinking here. It is so close. Well, I could play scenery, really. I don't really want to do that just yet. Anywho, um, we will charge seven bucks for this, and like this. No, we're not gonna. In fact, I actually see that right now. Our guest counts dropping. Uh, I think that might be because a lot of them are like, oh, they're tired. Cash in pocket. Say you. No, you haven't spent anything. I want to see like a few guests who are on their way back. Yeah, they spend everything. 52 minutes in our park. Okay. You? Yeah, you also... 1 hour and 43. That's more like it, really. Oh, you haven't spent anything. Alright, maybe, maybe it's not as bad as I thought it would be. No, I don't think we need to. But I'm not going to charge... Uh, seven bucks for this. We're gonna leave it at six, and I'm actually considering lowering it to like five. You know what? I just will. Best case, you know, what could happen is that we get an award for being the most valuable park in the country. So, yeah, that would be pretty nice. Um, right. We need to color this, name and shame it, and uh, we will. Let's take a look at it right now. Well, I think in terms of name, there is only one real option here, and that is King 
Cobra. I mean, <laughs> right next to Queen Cobra, so this has to be King Cobra. And uh, <laughs> again, the boner. <laughs> what is it with me opening that window? Um, then, we are... Oh, you didn't save the right name. Great. King Cobra. Right, then we will color this and we're gonna go with black tracks and the yellow line i mean cobras i don't really know their colors i do know they're black with like a painting on their oh, on their wings so to say if you know what i mean yeah supports are also are gonna be black as well i mean they're still supports so they they're not that bad really as we and we're gonna have this be green green with red in it that line pretty good well there it is ladies and gentlemen we got ourselves our first grand coaster <laughs> not the one that we just built despite oh man i don't know what it is really i don't think though i have much more choice with this one i could have built a lot of stuff over here but we are gonna have to somehow squeeze in another coaster here not going to be easy oh hell no but we are gonna try and do it and most likely pull it off but yeah like i'm saying probably not going to be that easy anyway that is all for next time when we play more roller coaster tycoon